My dear citizens, I welcome you to Avatar Country because today is a good day for me and therefore, of course, the kingdom. I have the great privilege to announce that the Royal Enema has been carried through successfully and I, your majesty, am no longer constipated. They actually say something almost like that. Keyword almost. This is basically a quote from the song The King's Speech off the new Avatar album, Avatar Country. So before we continue this review, I'm gonna take this ridiculous stuff off. One moment, please. <sighs> All right, probably got some crazy hair going on now, but uh, Shelby Small's here. Hey guys, I know it's been a while. Um, but today I am reviewing the new Avatar album, Avatar Country. It's been out for a week now and um, I cannot stop listening to it. Like, as soon as like the last song ends, I have to start the CD over again. Um, it's that good. So, before we like actually get started, I just wanna, <laughs> I have to read you the song titles because it, it's kind of funny actually. So, we have Glory to Our King, Legend of the King, The King Welcomes You to Avatar Country, King's Harvest, The King Wants You, The King Speaks, A Statue of the King, King After King, Silent Songs of the King, Part 1, Winter Comes When the King Orders, not orders, Drains of Snow, I can't read apparently, um, and <laughs> Silent Songs of the King, Part 2, The King's Palace. If you notice, every song has the word king in it, this is such an Avatar thing to do. I love that they did this. Like, they're so overly, like, obnoxious about this whole kingdom thing in this album. But it's like, it fits. It works really well. And it, it's so funny. Um, so, to kind of, like, dive a little bit more into the music itself. Um, so, you have, like, the Glory to Our King, and that's kind of like the intro track. And then it transitions into the second song, uh, Legend of the King. And the intro is phenomenal. Um, I love it because it has, like, this kind of like a classic pure metal sound and that kind of like sets the tone for the song. It's just, it's amazing. And it transitions really well from like the intro track. And then following that song is The, uh, the King Welcomes You to Avatar Country. And it's actually a country rock song, which is really weird because you go from like a classic metal sound to like a country rock song. And yet somehow Avatar makes it work. And it's weird because when I first heard it, I was like, wait, did I like, not take the shuffle off on my Spotify playlist because what is this? And I know all of the country songs on my playlist, so I was really taken back, but it was definitely Johannes's voice, so I knew it was Avatar. Um, and in fact, it's actually my favorite, if well, one of my favorite songs off the album. It's really hard to choose because every song is so great, but I love that they did this, and it shows that like they're really pushing the boundaries and kind of like trying new things, and they, they made it work. But then after this song, you transition into the heaviest song on the album. So classic metal, country rock, heaviest song on the album. And they make it work. It's so freaking good. So the third song is called The King's Harvest. And again, that's also probably one of my favorite songs, but again, I like all of the songs on the album. And then something else that was super unique that they did with the album, they ended it with two instrumental songs, which I thought was really cool. And the instrumental songs are so beautifully done that like you don't want to skip them. So it's, like, it's not very common that bands end an album with an instrumental song, not even just one, but like two. And that's not to say it's never been done, but like I said, it's just not very common. So I think that that's, you know, something really unique that they did, and it's a great way to close the album. Also, so you can actually see, um, yeah, yeah, here's, here's the album. So it's really cool. Uh, it actually comes with a really cool poster inside, but I'm not gonna show you. You're gonna have to buy the album so you can see the cool poster yourself. Um, all in all, this was a really fantastic album. So, without further ado, Game wants you! to check out the new album. See the links below so you know where to buy them and stream the new album, Avatar Country. Also, don't forget to like, comment, let me know what you thought of the album, and also, of course, subscribe. Stay tuned for part two because I am actually seeing Avatar tomorrow in San Antonio and they have a freak show coming and I'm really, really excited. So I'll be doing a review on their live performance and hearing Avatar Country um, in a live setting. So I'll see you later. Until next time, bye.